Hi there everyone from the Albert Park Grand Prix circuit. You all would have seen by now the news from Formula One that there's a rescheduled calendar for the 2021 season. The prevailing conditions of COVID around the world mean that sadly Melbourne will not be hosting the opening round of the 2021 season. But my best wishes go out to Salman and the team at the Bahrain International Circuit for what promises to be a great season opener for them. One of the opportunities we now have is to host the Formula One Australian Grand Prix in springtime in Melbourne. The last time a November event was held in Australia was actually in Adelaide in 1995. And what we're looking forward to doing is really creating the excitement that existed in Adelaide in that last year and the excitement that we normally have here in autumn as a season opener to being something absolutely special for the re-emergence of Formula One here in Albert Park. It will be the third last event the third last event is often where the championship is decided or it's coming down to the wire. Springtime in Melbourne is a beautiful time. It's nine days before summer and it does promise to be an exciting and safe event. That means that we've got a lot of challenges over the next 10 months. We don't have all the answers now. I'm not able to say right now when tickets will go on sale, but one of the things the team at the Grand Prix Corporation will be doing and working closely with the Victorian Government and Formula One is working at the configuration of the venue, the grandstands, the corporate facilities, the general ad admission offerings, because we're going to have a very, very special event for you. And when we've got those details, and I want to make sure that sooner rather than later, we're going to release those tickets, get on sale, and offer something very special to the fans. Thank you very much for your patience over what has been a challenging 2020 and an early part of challenges in 2021. Thanks to Formula One for your support, to the Victorian Government and most of all to the Grand Prix Corporation staff. They have been challenging times, but I know that for the next 10 months, we've got a great opportunity to deliver a wonderful event with full grandstands and beautiful sunny skies here in Melbourne. So we'll get on to all the details. Have a look at grandprix.com.au and stay tuned for what promises to be a great race.